Welcome. I'm going to show you a simple trick for drawing fairly realistic wood grain. Okay, first off, draw the shape of your wood and add a knot. The knot could be an oval or a circle, whatever. Next, add five tiny little dots just above the knot and pretty close in. Then add five more little dots along the length of the board in the direction you want the grain to go. It's really important that you space these dots farther and farther apart. If you need something specific, make each dot twice as far out as the previous one. You'll likely end up with one or more dots off the actual board, and that's okay. Next, connect the dots to draw the rings of the wood grain. As you loop the ring around, bring it close to the knot. You can imagine there are five dots there too, just like on the other side. Aim for those dots, though it's okay if you miss a little, like I did. The important thing is just to keep them close to the knot as you pass. As you get to the edge of the board, keep drawing in the air to add a sense of continuity as you loop back around. For the longer rings, draw with your whole arm. There's no movement at the wrist or the fingers, and this will give you smooth, confident looking lines. Even if it's a little imprecise, that's okay. There's lots of wiggle room here. If there's any empty space when it's all over, just continue the pattern. And there you go, a little shortcut for drawing classic, prototypical wood grain. If that works for you, great. Look out for part two, which will cover using this technique for multiple adjacent boards, like wood paneling and bowling lanes, and also some tips on shading and using wavy lines to make the wood grain look a little more natural. This technique and lots of other useful stuff is from my book, Drawing Made Easy, How to Draw from Observation and Imagination. Just came out July 31st, 2018 from Impact Books, and it's available at Barnes & Noble stores and lots of art supply stores and all over the place online, of course. Okay, thanks for watching.